Praise the Lord, everyone. Welcome to God Seller 7 channel. I'm Sister Barbara, and uh, I have a dream I'd like to share for, with you. You could join me in the New King James Version Study Bible. <clears throat> I'm going to be in Revelation chapter 8, verse 7. And the title of this passage is called, uh, First Trumpet Vegetation Struck. The first angel sounded, and hail and fire followed, mingled with blood, and they were thrown to the earth, and a third of the trees were burned up, and all green grass was burned up. <clears throat> and that is the dream I had. And I'll tell you what, I must have read that passage in the book Revelation hundreds and hundreds of times, and I never got it until I saw it. So here's the dream. I got this dream last night, and I woke up, and I could feel my heart pounding. I, I was really frightened from this. So I was on a street, and um, I was standing facing what looked like a, a, a town with, with maybe apartment buildings and so on. In the middle of the street I was standing. And um, I turned around, right, completely round, facing the other direction, and everything was on fire. All the trees were on fire. All the grass alongside of the streets were on fire. <clears throat> I could see smoke everywhere. As far as I could see on all the mountains, everything was burning. So, all of a sudden, right in front of me, where it was not on fire yet, these two huge trees uh, went up like torches. They were had to be 30 feet tall, the trees. They were green leaves on the trees, and they just went up in fire. So at that point, I realized there were other people on the street watching this with me, and everybody turned around and started running in the opposite direction towards this little town. So we came to an apartment building, and of course I was following these people that I have no idea who they were, but they were going into the apartment building, and they were going to the end apartment, and what they had decided was they were going to close, um, pull all the blinds down, lock the doors. They said there's no room for anyone else in here. There were several people in the room. And they started getting big towels and they started wetting them. And they were putting underneath the doors so small couldn't get in. And then they talked about what they were going to do next. They were going to wet the towels and wet the, all the walls down. So everything inside of the apartment uh, that they were hiding in would be soaking wet. And they were thinking this would spare them um, from being burned up. So as I stood there watching everything, I, I was just completely, I think, in shock, seeing everything on fire. I looked, uh, opened the blind on the edge, and I looked out, and I could see that the fire had already come alongside the apartment building. So what I did was I started to pray uh, to the Lord, just like in Exodus, uh, when the children of Israel were in Egypt, that this horrible thing would um, <clears throat> pass over everyone. So that's when I woke up. It was so frightening. But I remember standing there praying that, that, that the Lord would pass over and spare everyone in, that was in that apartment building. So again, a very frightening and disturbing um, dream. Uh, you might want to read uh, that scripture again, uh, Revelation, uh, about the vegetation struck. And again, I read it hundreds of times, and I didn't get it until I saw it. So I want to say, uh, repent and be baptized in Jesus' name. You'll receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. And again, I'm proclaiming the acceptable year of the Lord from now until September 23rd, uh, 2015, Yom Kippur, Day of Atonement. It's also called Day of Judgment. So again, thank you for tuning in to God's Hiller 7 channel. Have a blessed day today and a safe day. Amen.